Hey guys, welcome to this new Ruby tutorial here on my channel. My name is George and today we're going to learn how to do some mathematical operations in Ruby. Now for that, uh, I have a script over here which says math operations. That's really a simple message. And what we're going to do now is that we're going to try and uh, type in puts and then uh, we're going to make uh, some uh, multiplication, some sums, and all of that. So, for example, type in 5 plus 9. Now, if you type in that and we run the program, we will get math operations and then 14. Now, 14 is the result of uh, this sum over here, which is 5 plus 9, and you can print it out in the terminal just by typing the pot um, command over here. Now, uh, in Ruby, you can uh, do several operations uh, which are um, sums, also you got uh, subtraction, you get also to do division and multiplication and also you can use the the percentage uh, character to uh, do some model operations will, that will get you the residue of uh, divisions so if we type in for example 10 model 9 we will get the residue which is 1 and you get that and you can also do uh, divisions and all that kind of stuff for example you can do mul multiplication save the program run it and get uh, results um, by using this uh, math math uh, um, operands over here now uh, when you perform mathematical operations you can also perform uh, more complex operations not just two numbers over here you can say for example 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 plus 5 and with that you will get a result of a more complex operation with uh, multiple sums for example uh, if you run this code you will get 15 which is the result of this operation you can also mix uh, the type of oper operation you wanna make just like that however if you run this program you would see that the result is maybe a little bit uh, confusing over here. For example, if you get 1 and multiply by, by 2, that's 2, then plus 3, that's 5, then minus 4, that's 1, and then plus 5, okay, you get that result. But what will happen if you do, for example, a division over here? Go ahead and type in a division and you will get 1. And maybe it is a little uh, difficult to read this because as uh, you get 1 times 2 that's 2 divided by 3 that is basically 0 minus 4 uh, plus 5 that's 1 but sometimes this may be confusing because this operation this division over here uh, it will get you an integer number this is uh, not a decimal number so if you want to use decimal numbers you need to um, type in uh, the number in a decimal format for example 2.0 3.0 and ju just with those two numbers that's enough you can just save the program and you will get a decimal result now uh, I believe that this uh, way of typing in the, the operations may be a little bit confusing so I prefer to using parentheses now that is for um, like isolating your operations so you can say for example over here I want uh, to do a multiplication of 5 times 3 and then divide the result by another operation so you can isolate the, the operations and then do operations with those results for example 5 times 3 that would be 15 and I want to divide that by 5 minus 3 and I want it in a decimal format for example so I will get it that way save the program run the code and you will get 7.5 so these are some operations you can do with Ruby um, these are really simple operations um, before we end the video I just wanted you to uh, know that you can also make comparisons in Ruby and how is that? that is uh, with other uh, signs over here you can use the greater than or less than or well, these are the most simple uh, comparisons so you can say for example is this operation greater than this other operation over here and you can go ahead and save the program and try again and see what happens you will get 
true and that's because 5 times 3 which is 15 is really greater than 5 minus uh, 3 and if you put over here the the less than um, sign you you can run the program and you will see that the result will be false because this is a false a statement you, you, when you make this comparison so that's uh, just something for you to know we will see uh, more comparisons more comparisons later in this uh, series and I believe that's all for now so I hope you guys learned something how to do some math operations these are really simple operations in Ruby uh, if you like the video don't forget to click on the like button and comment in the comment section below and subscribe to my channel if you haven't done already so that's pretty much it for now and I will see you later in the next video. Bye bye.